Hello everybody, welcome to another edition of my F-150 Platinum channel. Um, so, as I said kind of in my intro video, um, this channel is just going to be all about my 2014 F-150 and um, everything that I do to it from the time I purchased it um, until the time I hand it down to my kids or um, trade it in, which probably will be about the next decade so um, anyway so today um, is going to be kind of our first mod um, on the vehicle so um, the day I got my truck home I decided that I was going to try to get it to fit in the uh, garage and I'm still working on that but one of the things that I noticed in trying to get it into the garage is that the antenna um, I wasn't even watching it, and man, I smacked that antenna pretty good going into the garage. Forgot about it, smacked it again coming out, and uh, already bent it. So, um, obviously I needed a new antenna, and uh, so I went and looked for one online, looked for reviews, um, you know, and ended up going to Amazon. Um, I figured it wasn't probably something I needed to buy from one of the truck sites. Um, Amazon would probably have a bigger selection, and they did. And um, there was probably a hundred to uh, to pick from. So anyway, um, I found one that was like regularly priced a hundred and something dollars, but it was uh, like on clearance or on special or something was going on with it, and. Um, it was like 25 bucks so I figured well, for $25 you know you can't really go wrong so I bought it and um, let's take a look at uh, installing it and uh, obviously the install parts all of about two minutes it's not that difficult to swap out an antenna and uh, then we'll get back in the truck and we'll uh, we'll talk about it so my truck barely fits in my garage and every time I pull it in the garage that antenna hits the top so I went on Amazon and looked for a shorter antenna and found this little guy right here I'll put a link in the description below but we're gonna give it a try it was about $24, but it was one of those crazy markdown items that was normally over $100. So we're going to go ahead and unscrew the old antenna, put the new antenna on, and uh, we'll drive it a little bit and see how the reception is. Alright, so I've taken the old, uh, the old antenna out. There's the new antenna. Didn't come with any instructions, but it seems pretty simple. So I have the antenna. Looks like I just need to use this connector, screw one end into the antenna, and the other into the housing. So let's give it a try. Alright, so the new antenna is in. Guys, I'm sorry my truck's dirty. I've washed it like four days in a row, but we've been getting dust storms and then rain. Dust storms and then rain. So there's the, uh, the new antenna. We'll take it for a drive here in a minute and see what the reception sounds like all right so we're back in the truck and um i've been driving it for a little while here so um you know not that you're going to pick up a ton but i figured i'll just pull off to the side here real quick and uh, i apologize if there's background noise um with the AC and the cell phone where it is, um, I live in Arizona, it's hotter than hell right now, so I've got the AC turned down a little bit, um, just so I can make this video, but truthfully speaking, it's hot, so if I'm sweating or something, it's because I'm trying to make it so that you hear me and not the air conditioning. So, at any rate, um... I'm going to put it on an FM channel really quick, and we'll uh, go from here. Alright, 
So now let's try an AM station. Back in the lineup tomorrow, uh, and Eduardo's been playing every single day. It's just time for me to get him off of his feet. We're going into a very tough venue with it, with a lot of heat tomorrow in Texas, and I want to make sure he's full. All right, so that is both AM and FM, and I don't know if it came through uh, my speakers and into the phone correctly, but that's the same exact sound um, that I was getting from the factory antenna. Um, I don't live out in the sticks, but I don't live downtown either. So that reception is perfectly okay. Um, as you guys know, this is the 2014 Platinum. So I also have the ability to pair it with my um, iPhone. And I have Sirius Satellite Radio that came with the vehicle. So, I mean, if I'm driving way out of town, um, I don't really see the necessity to... Um, to have an antenna that can get me just this obscene range um, you know anything that's going to pick up a really decent signal um, is going to be fine and the radio is picking up the uh, HD signal just fine and uh, really didn't have any issues so I'm going to give this little $25 antenna a 5 out of 5 stars um, I went ahead and I put a link to the Amazon where I got it in uh, there's gonna be a link in the description below so um, if you guys are looking for a short little nub antenna and um, and you haven't wanted to spend a ton of money I think probably $25 is gonna be the cheapest mod you can possibly give your truck and if you don't have an F-150 or you have a later year F-150 um, you can go through and select which vehicle and um, go from there. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and buy one for my son Silverado and um, my wife's Dodge Grand Caravan. So, um, you know, I think that it's going to be for $25. I don't know how long they'll be $25. So as long as they're $25, um, I'd grab one for, hell, I'd grab one for all your vehicles for $25. Bucks. But anyway, there is a link in the description below so please check it out uh thank you for watching and uh truck on we'll see you next week